Yo guys, what is up? This is Real American Studios, and welcome to another episode of the Pokemon Ruby Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're having a great day. Um, the weather is pretty nasty outside here. We're actually getting tornado warnings, but we're going to pull through this episode anyway while the house is empty. But yeah, guys, uh, question of the day, what is your favorite game, like video game, like what I mean? Um, if you enjoy this episode, make sure to leave a like. Also, leave a comment below and, you know, answer the question of the day. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and join my Discord, all linked in the description below. And make sure to leave a like. Let's try to get this video to 10 likes. All right, 10 likes. I think we can do it. And, um, yeah, guys, anyways... Uh, just a quick intro. Let's get into a team recap. It's going to be a pretty short episode today. <clears throat> but if you missed the last episode, make sure to go check it out. But starting off, we have Rogue the Requaza at level 20. Intimidate ability and the moves Dragon Claw, Scary Face, Ancient Power, and Twister. Next up, we have Joy657 the Gyarados at level 24. Water and Flying type, Stench ability, Holding the Ambulate Coin. With Thrash, Future Sight, and Bite. Next up, we have PBTZ, the Espeon at level 25, Psychic Type minus ability, holding the Twisted Spoon. With the moves Confusion, Quick Attack, Moonlight, and Sand Attack. Next up, we have Wilma the Linoon at level 24, with the Runaway ability. She is a normal type, and with the moves Headbutt, Sand Attack, Odor Sleuth, and Tackle. Next up, we have Pink the Crobat at level 21, Liquid Ooze Ability, Poison and Flying Type, holding the Experience Share with the moves Sweet Kiss, Rock Smash, Wing Attack, and Bite. And last but not least, we have Dwarf the Sly King at level 23 with the Effect Spore Ability. He is a normal type with Strength, Yawn, Faint Attack, and Slack Off. And that's the team. And today... You know, probably a little bit of a risk. We're going into the gym, though. We're going into the gym. That's a fortress. Not really ideal. Yeah, we're not. We're not risking this. But I really don't have anything else for it. Protect. Nice job, bro. Got hit me with the double protect. Super potion. Up. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna be looking to fight all the gym trainers though. And it probably wasn't in my best interest to come in here. So there's a possibility that I might just spend a lot of the episode grinding up as well. But that's just what I'm thinking. So I'm going to take on these gym trainers. I'm probably going to grind up. Wait, I'm definitely going to do some grinding. Yeah. So I'm going to finish off all the gym trainers and then do some grinding. gonna be a grinding episode I really kind of wish I had like decided to you know um, I'm trying to think I mean I might take on the gym yeah but I'm I'm not really ready for the gym yet I'm pretty confident in my team going into the gym battle with me. Yeah. 
have no way in puny trainer, how can I do no way? You're stupid. You're stupid. And then, like I said, after this, I'm going to probably go to the fifth gym, take on all the trainers there, and then I'm going to come back here and just grind. It's a Cinequil level 26. I should be able to take this thing now. Look at that. Intimidate cutting its attack. I mean, Rogue's already trying to destroy this thing. Rogue just doesn't like other Pokemon. That's why he intimidates everything. Look at that, nearly taking that thing down right off the bat. Boom! Send the quills down. Rogue. Get some experience from that. Clefairy. Um. I'm going to go out the Dwarf. I think Dwarf can handle a Clefairy. It's just a Clefairy, I mean. I'm going to go ahead and hit it with a Yawn to begin with. A Yawn. Go ahead and try to put it to sleep. It's going to double slap me, but that's going to do absolutely nothing. It's called double slap, but it's hitting three times. That makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Oh, my <laughs> This Clefairy pretty much stands no chance of anything. It's going to sleep now. Clefairy's down. Slowpoke. Hmm. I think Rogue, because I really don't think a Slowpoke can do too much to Rogue. I mean. Unless it has ice beam for some reason. Oh, it's just a slow poke. I was thinking slow bro, but it's just a slow poke. Yeah, all these. Uh, this gym leader just had a bunch of first stage mods. You're like, see, it can't really do much to me. Alright, so she's gonna go ahead and use a hyper potion. So that slowpoke is nearly dead. And this twister will finish it off. That's going to do it for the gym battle. As Rogue will grow to level 22. As I completely wreck Flannery. Let's see what TM50 contains. Calm Mind would be awesome on. Actually, you know what? Joy657, because I'm not that far from getting Surf. Like, I'm not that far from getting Surf. Oh, yeah, that's right. She's going to give me the Go Goggles. So what I can do, I can go in there, in the uh, in the desert, and train up my bonds. I can go up here and get the Master Ball real quick. Soul Dude. Alright, but yeah, I can get... So I can get another encounter here. Ooh, a Seedra, not bad. A Seedra, a Seedra is not bad at all. I caught it. And I'm gonna name it. Hmm. I'm gonna name it. Nikki, I don't know why, just Nikki. I really don't know why. I just did. And then I'm gonna start repelling now. Oh, that's a star beat. Oh man, the bag's full. Bag is full. Got 
a star piece of money. Oh, he's going to send out a breloom. We're going to destroy his breloom. And I'm actually going to take that experience share off of pink now. Crap. Because I want my other Pokemon to be getting full experience now. Alright, so this dude's going to want to battle me. He's got a spinner egg. So this chick's gonna battle me. She's got a Matagros. Um, I don't really know what to go out to. I'll go out to my pseudo legendary as well, I guess. something for that metagross because otherwise I could have been destroyed I wonder what TM23 is crab hammer oh and joy can learn it too I'm getting rid of future sight for crab hammer hey Z want to hear a secret Crab hammer. Alright, so this chick's gonna wanna battle me. She's got a Growlithe. Growlithe's dead. And she's got a Volbeat. Volbeat's dead as well. Your Volbeat is dead as well, lady. I dig it. Hey Z, you want to hear a secret? Crap, ever. Fossil sounds a lot cooler, but I took the root fossil. And my dog happens to be scared of thunder. Cookie, calm down. It's just a little bit of thunder, Cookie. You're okay, girl. so she can get up there with the rest of the team. That's one less level I have to train her up. I'm going to try to train, like, grind all my Pokemon up to level 30. That's why I'm thinking level 30 for all my Pokemon. Ooh, I can go into the Trick House. I do want to, like, go ahead and get the Fossil Pokemon. First things first, I'm going to the trick house. Alright, so this guy's gonna be right here. 
Master Ball upgrade. Alright, I'm gonna battle this kid and absolutely wreck his Swablu. Looks like a job. Go ahead and take down the A-Palm. Toted Dog, go ahead and take that thing down too. Go ahead. This chick's going to want to battle me. She's going to send out this stupid sub floor. I'm going to take it down. Onyx. Looks like a joy for a job for joy and crab hammer. Just finding a stab move like that for my Gyarados definitely was not a bad thing at all. This puzzle was too easy, man. This puzzle was way too easy. I'm sure I can come here and get Black Flute. Way too easy, man. Alright, so we'll go over here. Alright, finish that puzzle in literally like 10 seconds. He's gonna give me a timer ball. That's cool, I guess. Another ball. You can never have too many balls. Alright, so he's gonna be up here at this dresser. So, no, we don't want to go that way. Well, this puzzle's a little bit harder, I know. That Blaziken. Oh, yeah, that's right. Air Iron. And Armor Iron. Who do I really want to get up some levels? I'm going to put Joy. Send out this Walrein. Dragon Rage. Uh, I'll get rid of Bite for Dragon Rage. Murkrow. Uh, I guess I'll send out Pink. I didn't see what was coming out. Feebaz. That's an easy kill. Alright, so this guy is a, apparently he's a pansy now. Alright, I really want that Pokeball that's just sitting right there now. I really want that Pokeball that's just sitting right there now. Get that Pokeball or something. I mean, dang, man. Guess I can at least battle the trainers. Crap. I just box myself in. I believe I just boxed myself in. Oh, that's fucking nice. Don't do stupid stuff like that, kids. Alright, give me... Am I just never going to be able to get this Pokeball or something? I just want the Pokeball. Really? 
I want the Pokeball. Yes. I just boxed myself in again. I'm sure this guy doesn't have any more tricks up his sleeve, so no. But that was okay experience for my mind, I guess. And I guess I can stop by this Pokemon and sell stuff. Sell everything that I don't need. This is the last time I ever just have to see you again. Everybody wave bye to Mr. Bernie because we're never going to see this dude again. Nobody cares about your trainer tips. Your trainer tips literally in no way help me. I'm literally already the goat. Like, you can't help a goat. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to run in here and get the fossil of these morons in there. And there's a possibility it could go on my team. If it's something good. Well, I got to go to the box of Pokemon. I guess. I guess I got to go box of Pokemon. That's okay, but just trash. I never actually checked Nikki's ability to you know. Oh, true on it? Nah. Yeah, Nikki is definitely not power on the PC, and neither is that Beedrill. Neither is that Beedrill. Alright. Let's see who I really need to train. Dwarf, you're gonna get some training in this gym, my dude. Oh man, I just saw some lightning guys. I don't like that very much. Well, you're, we're gonna return somewhere and grind up, though. But we're gonna battle each and every one of these rooms. The accuracy room. This chick's gonna be like. It's a Psyduck. I mean, I'm not really worried about a Psyduck. Mankey, I'm, I'm not even at all worried about a Mankey. And the bad thing about it, I'm a normal type and I wasn't worried about that. What's the bad thing about that? Who do I really want to get up now? I, mean, I 
guess Wilma. Um, hello? Um, wait. What the heck just happened? Clicking out of this game real quick, guys. You you saw that too, right? My freaking character and everything disappeared. You guys saw that too, right? Wait. Right. <laughs> That's just weird, guys. Well, I know you guys saw that too. Speaking of badges, I gotta put uh, four gym badges on. But you guys saw that too, right? Like, that was just weird. But as you can see, my badges are gonna change. Right there, four gym badges. I just thought that was a little weird. strength run. Wait, like some strange things was happening there, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not even going to lie. There were some strange going on there. Alright, so I've already went in here, right? It's the recovery room. This is where they recover their HP and all that. Alright, Pink. Job well. Job well. That that crit probably mattered. Oh my God! A Raikou and a one-hit KO is actually scary, guys. I'm not even gonna front you guys. That. I think I've battled all the trainers in here. So really. end this episode off guys and I'll be going live with some grinding I think that's going to be the move guys some grinding but guys yeah uh, thank you for watching I know this was a shorter and less eventful episode but thank you guys for watching Real American Studios out peace out all my homies